this is a brief reminder that you need to watch the previous video. It is about the name of God as God speaks it and the prophecy that is therein. There is a testimony in God being the God of Abram, Isaac and Jacob. It is beautiful but it's more than that. It leaves you speechless in its glory. It has meaning that you need to hear. Meaning that runs far greater than Jesus being born from that line. Because it is a testimony of his name. Thus, in those names, there is spoken something regarding the Shem, the name of God. You need to hear that. There are such few people that have seen that. How can you not know the name of God? The most beautiful name imaginable. Spoken as he declares it. There is a prophecy that you cannot miss. There is a testimony in God being the God of Abram, Isaac and Jacob that is so profoundly strong and glorious. It truly is the answer as to who has sent Moses. Why do we need to know who sent Moses? Of course the people of old know that in the literal, but why do we need to? Because even in Moses, God placed prophecy. There is prophecy of Messiah in Moses. There is prophecy of Messiah's resurrection in Moses. Moses is the one that can come up from the water, and water in Hebrew ties with wasting. That's the one that can come up, that can rise from the resurrection. Who can send us resurrection? Most important question. We are doomed being sinners. We are transgressors, and the punishment for sin is death. Who can send us resurrection? Who sends us a deliverer that can take us out of the place of our captivity to sin? The verdict being death prophesied in Egypt. Remember, they can never get out of there. They couldn't get out of there by their own works. They worked and worked and worked so hard like a slave, but nothing helped. They stayed put there. They couldn't get out. We can't get out of it. We can't get out of the rule of the captivity place of death. We're enslaved to the death verdict's rule. And we cannot please it by our works because it doesn't fulfill the verdict which is there. We stuck. So who can send us deliverance? Who can send us resurrection? Who can free us and take us to the promised land which is heaven? Who can give us life if we doom to death? That is the question. The most important question in a human mouth. And the most glorious answer is the name of God. You cannot miss that. You must know what you say when you say, I serve the God of Abram, Isaac, and Jacob. Because the answer God gave you and me by the mouth of Moses, by the resurrection testimony of Jesus, is that it is a prophecy. Please watch the previous video. Know the name of the God you serve. Spoken as he 